I'm going to take you on a tour of the art room. You can see there's my workstation. Kids use my computer too. I didn't bother cleaning anything even though it looks fairly decent in here. <laughs> Up here is free time station. Before I started Choice, Everyone got to partake in the free time station. Later, when I opened the architecture station, this is when archite where architecture will be. For my K2s, they use this as a free time station. There's lots of di different options during their free time. Obviously, it's not very clean right now. This is my workstation right now, and they also have a break station under there. Some of my kiddos that need more breaks. This is, I'm getting ready for a sub. Here's where the iPad is. I also have two iPhones that are not here right now because they're getting worked on by my wonderful IT husband. Here are bracelets. I am in the process of creating a poster board or a wood board, I think is what's gonna end up being, to where they have different colored bracelets for each station because our stations are getting extremely crowded and each station will have its own color and we'll only have six in the station. Come around this way. We've got painting, that's kiln room, storage, my tall desk, table bins for my K2s that go to each table. And then we get into the drawing station. The drawing station I'll zoom in so you can see the posters. Wonderful ideas that I've found on the internet. So many great ideas out there from other art teachers. We do ATCs, like four fives do. And examples, QR codes. We use QR codes for different videos I've made for demonstrations, different projects I want to hang on to. Again, let me remind you, I just started opening and just went to Choice for my 3-5 this year. So we only have two stations open so far. There's my helper tables for my younger kiddos, my arty smarty word wall, what we're doing. Today I am, and so that I can. We do golden paintbrush, we track, they earn art parties. Here's where I keep all the portfolios, collage bins. This is obviously where the collage station is eventually going to be. All the classes keep their portfolios. Up here is where all my choice based classes are gonna be keeping all their work. Sorry, starting to add up. And of course, 3D work all over the place. I do, I am blessed with three sinks it's amazing and a most wonderful drying rack that i just got last year and had a fun race for and over here would be the painting station zoom in i made a painting station video for cleanup setup and cleanup that kids need to watch sometimes they need a reminder when it's not cleaned up properly. And everything in the room is labeled so that kiddos can work their studio. And here you'll see station coded. But when I open the drawing and the painting, we keep sketchbooks, each class. They are plan, do, reflect inside. So I always ask them, are you in the plan, are you in the do, or are you in the reflect? We also keep self-tracking. They keep, they will pick two a quarter. I do many lessons at the beginning of every class. Helps meet all standards. I do national and Missouri. I also have art auditors. Each class is given a board each quarter. I switch out two art auditors and they keep track of where, well, they help manage this clipboard and everyone records where they were that day and what station. So I can look across and be like, oh, well, that's where you've been. You can see that we've had two weeks of drug free posters and finishing posters. I have to take breaks for those mandatory things. Don't mind, I always make it a lesson out of it. 
And I guess that's the classroom.